An undefeated season stopped in its tracks. Ohio State taking down Notre Dame on the road. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Chris Jacobs. Curtis has the night off. WLWT News 5 anchor Lindsey Stone is live tonight in South Bend where that game just ended. We can all take a breath right now and Lindsey, it literally came down to the last second. I'm sure there's plenty of mixed emotions at Notre Dame Stadium. So what's the energy out there like right now? Yeah, Chris, I think I say this on behalf of a lot of college football fans. I'm kind of in shock at what we just saw. And right now, so many fans, as you can see, reacting to what we just watched. Everyone leaving Notre Dame Stadium right now. I just saw a Notre Dame fan walk over to Ohio State fan. He said, hey, man, good game. But yes, Chris, certainly mixed emotions here. What a game it was. It came down to the wire, and it really was a nail biter. Obviously, Notre Dame fans are hurting right now, and Ohio State fans walking Away with this victory. Now, our Olivia Ray is going to join us now to break down those highlights. Olivia, we heard from Ryan Day. He said, it's Ohio versus the world. What a game it was. What can you tell us about what this team was able to do to really pull off the victory tonight? Lindsay, like you said, Ryan Day, quite emotional post game, actually throwing a few shots at Lou Holtz for criticizing his team earlier in this week. Number nine, Notre Dame, they'd rattled off four dominant wins to start this season. The first real test of 2023, the sixth ranked Buckeyes, fighting Irish QB Sam Hartman, making his 50th start on his college career today. Ohio State's Kyle McCord getting the nod for the fourth time, and oh, by the way, his first primetime appearance since high school. McCord's biggest weapon, Marvin Harrison Jr. banged up in the third quarter, but this Ohio State offense still gutsy enough to stun the entire city of South Bend, which you are standing in right now, Lindsay. With one minute and 25 seconds on the clock, McCord leads a game-winning drive, came down to the very final second. A walk-off winner by Chip Trainum at the buzzer, and the Buckeyes are able to walk away with the win 17-14. An incredible evening in South Bend. I will have full highlights coming up in sports, plus the full highlights of that Big 12 opener, UC and OU. Lindsay, I'm going to send it back to you in South Bend for that stunning finish. Yeah, it was stunning. And as you can see, a lot of fans are finally leaving. You know, it really was all about the fans tonight. Usually if you come out to a college football game in the fourth quarter, you will start to see some fans trickle out. That was not the case. Every fan glued to their seats watching this game play out. I caught up with a few who drove here from Ohio. Divided household. They had plenty to say about tonight's game. That's going to be coming up in a couple of minutes. For now, Chris, I'll send it back to you in the studio. All right, Lindsay, thank you so much.